Anya Taylor-Joy sports a ring on that finger as she steps out in NYC, amid rumors she married. Musician Bo Malcolm McRae last summer. Anya Taylor-Joy added fuel to rumors that she secretly wed boyfriend Malcolm McRae as she stepped out in NYC with a rock on her ring finger Friday night. The 26-year-old actress, who recently dazzled fans with her Spanish, flaunted a short, glossy, red manicure as she nonchalantly flashed the glinting piece of jewelry. The blonde stunner styled her glossy platinum locks in a side part and a low, sleek bun. She was dressed in a scoop-neck white blouse that she tucked into a black miniskirt. The Queen's Gambit sensation put on a leggy display in a pair of black fishnet tights that had a small hole on one leg. The Miami-bred entertainer wore black leather knee-high boots as she hit the streets of the Big Apple. The beauty, who starred in 2022's horror comedy The Menu, topped her look with a gray and black plaid blazer. Peeking out from under the sleeves and adorning her hands was a sheer, black cupcake sleeve. The stunner was makeup-free as she whizzed past fans while on the move in the city. Malcolm, who shares a birthday with the actress, is a member of the rock band Moore. It's not clear when the two began dating, though Anya previously mentioned having a bad breakup prior to filming her 2020 film Emma, but the actress confirmed she was in a relationship in April 2021. Rumors have swirled that the pair secretly tied the knot after Anya was pictured on several occasions in Sydney wearing what appears to be a wedding ring, but she has yet to comment on the speculation. It was claimed at the time that Anya had secretly married her rocker boyfriend after one year of dating. The couple confirmed their relationship at the Vanity Fair Oscars party in March 2022. It was claimed in July 2022 that the actress and the musician had tied the knot in a modest courthouse ceremony in the U.S. Anya and Malcolm were said to be planning a larger ceremony with friends and family once the actress wrapped filming Mad Max, Fury Road prequel, Furiosa, in Australia, and was able to return home to Los Angeles for a longer period. The source claimed the actress jetted back to Australia shortly after the wedding to resume filming.